Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel and today we will be looking at some of the best and the most useful plugins of September 2019. Yes, it's September already and we have gotten some very useful new plugins. So without further ado, let's just get started. So the first plugin actually takes uh, effect the plugins panel. It basically utilizes the new plugins panel support. So if I click on my color panel, which is the uh, new awesome plugin, uh, I will be able to see the entire color spectrum right inside uh, Adobe XD. And this is something that was missing from Adobe XD and even many other UI design or visual design tools and I can even change the border uh, color as well not just the uh, fill so for example I have a rectangle and I want a specific color I can choose from this uh, humongous spectrum the border color as well as the fill so I can change everything from here and the, again, these are flat colors. I can even uh, bring material colors in. And as you can see, it, it changes the spectrum. And once you're ready with this, uh, you can just copy this over and you can just apply it to the fill right here and you'll have that exact same color. Now, it also allows you to auto change. What does this mean? If I want, uh, if I click on green, it'll change the green, see how it changes. And this is one of the best plugins that take full advantage of the new capabilities in Adobe XD and then this is pretty pretty awesome this is one of my favorite of all time so kudos to the developer for this awesome plugin so the next plugin is actually an unreleased plugin which is available only on github I'll give the link in the description if you go to github click on download and download zip uh, you will get a zip file once you extract that all you need to do is go to this file called this this dot xdx it could be any file name once you get that once you install it into xd you will be able to run it so box icons is uh, basically allows you to um, select what kind of icon you want regular solid or logos i'll select solid and i can select an icon so I'll search for an icon called home. Once I click on home and I say search, uh, it gives me a different uh, kind of option. So I can say box home circle. If I click on this and I say copy to clipboard and I just paste it here. As you can see, an icon has been pasted and this is a cool icon library which you can get. And you can definitely edit these. These are all just uh, lines and anchor points which have been created into these icons. A beautiful icon library, again, unreleased. So you can go ahead and download it from the GitHub library. So box icons it is. So the next icon is basically a great selection tool and it is called select menu. So I have one circle, one rectangle and one text element which says element. You know just like that and just random elements right here so i want all text so it'll select all text from this artboard uh, i want uh, area text there is no area text so it'll show me no area text so for example i lock this circle i want to see all the elements that have been locked i'll say locked items and it'll show me the locked items right here on my artboard Again, this is great if you have a very large project and you're trying to just find elements which are similar to each other. Okay, so this is an old plugin, but it has a very unique new user interface inside Adobe XD. Uh, it's called UI Faces and it does exactly what it says. For example, I want to fill somebody's face inside this circle. I'll go to UI Faces and now it has all the options here. So I can select the image size and I can select which website I want it from so IMDB will probably give me a film star uh, I can select the age of the person as well isn't this super duper interesting so I want him to be between 20 and 24 and I want him to be a male and happiness uh, any any of these and I'll just press apply and it'll take a couple of seconds it uh, let's the algorithm work once the algorithm is done see it's picked up a an actor probably and he's smiling he's a male between 20 24 years of age this is 
absolutely excellent, uh, especially for projects where you have a lot of people's faces to be used. Everything is here in the plugins panel now. So the next plugin is an absolutely amazing plugin and it's new. It's called Free Stock Search for XD. And if I click on this, uh, and it allows me to search for an image. So if I want to search for an image called girl, it'll show me all the images of a girl or a, or a woman in these images. And uh, as you can see, these girls are, are now here. I, ca I can even change where I want uh, these images to come from. So Pexels or Pixabay or Unsplash, even Shutterstock or Adobe XD. So uh, this is a great tool. You can search for anything you want. My favorite topic would have to be dogs. And you have all these cute dogs while you work here. And you can select any one of the, these and this plugin will download it and put it into your uh, artboard right here. See, it's put this image inside this element. What if I click on, on a text and then click on this? Okay, it just covers it up. I was being crazy with that. I hope you liked that video. If you did, please consider subscribing to the channel and also clicking on that bell icon right next to it. And like this video and comment down below which was your favorite plugin out of all of these. And I'll see you next video every Monday and Thursday. God bless.